Hello and welcome back another week some more Love Victor. Um I think this will be the first week that I've acknowledged it. Uh, last week should have been done correctly, but we're condensing two episodes together. So we're going to be doing cuz it's it, it does make more sense. I've thought about it. I got a couple of comments and it does it does make sense cuz if we're doing one episode there's like 10 ish episodes a season. And that's like 30 weeks. That's a lot of time. Uh, we love Love, Victor. But there's so many more shows, you know, to do to get to that's out there. Um, so we might, that for this season at least, I think we'll be doing at least like one episode maybe for the first and last. And then uh, depending on like even or odd numbers, we'll see how we go with the next seasons. Because I haven't looked at them. Like I don't want to see the thumbnails or anything yet. I uh, want to see how it's go first. But this one will be the first one where we're watching both like together last week it will be <laughs> i filmed two videos then made the decision and st- stuck them together this one will be a full ride so you'll get me for the for the for patreon uh first of all if you'd like to watch the full length uh, episodes uh, uh along with me uh we have all that on patreon if you'd like to go link down below um but yeah if you're on patreon you got me for <laughs> A double time, full time this uh, this week, which is fun. Instead of uh, two episodes back to back, you just got more me, which is always great. Um, but yeah, a YouTuber might at least make a bit more sense the jump between episodes. I won't just be in a new, look different, new personality, new, <laughs> completely different to what I was. But um, I'm just really excited to jump into this. This show's fun and joyful, and I'm like always excited to get into it and see what our guys are gonna get up to and re-remember these things from the first season um, and see what's happening. The only other disclaimer is I'm a bit sick at the moment, so I'm sorry if I sound awful or nasally. Uh, I will try and keep it under wraps for everyone. Uh, but other than that, like and subscribe, that would be great, and let's get into it. Hey Benji, can you open the and hand me the Ew <laughs> Ew They're like Ew fuck. If someone looked at me like that my heart would explode. Hey handsome, what's up? Hey, no boy. Handsome, shut the fuck up. We are handsome. He's, he's off the table, so I can focus on Mia. Yeah, I don't know if that's is that what you wanna focus on? I'm happy about that. I'm happy you got your people. And maybe the other coaches that add me to their group text. Oh, <laughs> okay, you scored on Cooperman. I'd like to see you make that shot on me. Yeah. I will make that shot on literally fucking anyone. I didn't, I didn't mean like right now. Okay, I wasn't... Well, always be ready. On the court, ready to play. <laughs> that dems the rules, bitch. Back in Texas during regional semis, she got ejected from the game for excessive dancing. Since Well, that's not the worst thing. Excessive, like, enjoys watching you twerk like a geriatric abuse Cardi B. Could be worse. Like, if she's just slurring out the refs, she's like, You fuckhead. I'm just talking about the basketball game. I love oh. all my kids exactly the same. That's not true. If you rank us, I'd be on top, right? Definitely. Yeah. Oh, that's cute. Oh, you're still here? <laughs> she, she's still cute. Oh, I like it. But, like, we've got something going on. How you were able to make it for dinner, Felix? Again? And breakfast. Oh, but yeah, I knew he was going to do a... You live here. I think it's Guys, cute. I feel that way, too. <laughs> He's like, I want to be part of the family. I, I was like, I wish I had that sort of person. I, I feel like I did for a while. I had a, a good friend like that. But now I live at a home, so I don't have that anymore. Isabel, she needs your guidance the most because she's nasty and she knows it. Amen. Oh, that's a wild... Jealous about Victor's big game. Oh, you it's not that. Not speak to me that way. Ooh. Your room. Not in front of the Lord, ma'am. Oh, but no pizza? No, like, if my parents were, like, they could they could take anything away from me. But food? You guys, uh, I'd lose it. Nice roast style. Ooh, <laughs> that's a, that's a ee moment. Do a slice of sausage. One slice? Bitch, she could have bought me one of those. I never understand. It can't be about mom's pun families. Pun. Of course not. They order like two pizzas for like ten, pe- five people. What? Oh. No, she didn't. Oh, yes, she did. Stop watching Jimmy Kimmel after he got skinny because she was having impure thoughts. There's no way she had. Oh, 
yeah, but everything's been going wrong. Wrong and wild and weird. <laughs> wild and wacky. Please talk to... Don't give up on us. Yep, Simon. Ooh. And he just had to message right now. I love that him and Simon are, like, weirdly friends. The fact that he doesn't know <laughs> Simon and he's, like, messaging him, I'm in love with a boy. I have a... You know, a girlfriend that I'm trying to focus on. My mum's having a fair... He hasn't said that yet, but it's, like, kind of the vibe where he's going. And Simon's just like, oh, my God, I've invested in this guy's life. Imagine someone just messages you and you're like, yep, we're the new B- B- BFFs. We are going to... Oh, it's wild. Be some random stalker and move on with our lives. Are we going to message back? So should we just ask her who he is? No way. she just make up some lie. Oh, we're gonna be pretend to be mom. Pilar. What? She won't know. And get this, he's coming to Atlanta on Friday to attend a conference. A conference. The only conference he's trying to attend is in mom's pants. Ooh, yuck. That's why. Really? I like, I'm in for the drama, but you don't talk about your mom's pants like that. I'm sorry, sweetie. No matter how close you are, that's wild. <laughs> that's wild, yuck. Bitch, Pillar, you've crossed lines. You've crossed lines, boundaries. Whoo! Shivers just thinking about it. Profit that supports women through economic and social initiative. Oh no, she's like golden. Make the world a better place. That's one thing I love about her. Oh, love. No, I'm kind of with it. I want people to be happy. It's inedible. I'm sure it's going to yeah. be great. He cooks, which is one of the things I love about him. <laughs> love. We're throwing that word around. Like, seriously. I mean, it's not I love you, but love about is still pretty wild. How do we know which one is Roger? His only profile picture is a dog. Oh. Oh, look at the Bark? I don't know. Two drinks. Obviously waiting for someone. No offense to this man, but give your mum some... No, give your mum some credit. She can do... She could do well. Breaker. I'm starting to think no. this is a bad idea. Your mom is a very attractive lady. And you've already talked about her pants. So you should know who she's getting. I know that guy. That's dad's old boss. Oh. The plot thickens. Owen was the foreman. This, this guy was the big boss. The big boss. Company holiday party back in Texas. Holy shit. Get it? How would mom even know his big boss? And why would they? Let's go. We didn't even yeah. get to talk to him. We're going. Oh, but we know what happened. Yeah, Pilar, please protect your little brother. It's my career first. Got it. Ever have any children? Nope. Well, how many partners have you not had children with? Mia Brooks. Okay, that one's maybe a bit a lot for dinner time conversation. As monoxide. <laughs> I'm sorry about this, Veronica. My daughter. <laughs> They're like. We don't care, like. It's okay, Harold. I think I understand what's going on here. I think I do too. And we get to talk about it in front of everyone. Your dad is in a real relationship and that freaks you out. Yes. But Mia, I just want you to know I'm not trying to replace your mother. I wish yeah. you would replace my mother because then you wouldn't even be here. Hey! Oh, snap, though. That was, that was kind of a good retort. Oh! Oh, no. <laughs> She's like, for what it's worth, I like you. Love this. <laughs> She's like, this will be mine. Oh, I feel bad. Veronica, was it? I liked you. But obviously, complicated feelings for me. We're, we, we're here to support her through her journey. I promise don't say anything to mom until after the game. Yeah. yeah. Pilar, you've been sitting on it for a little bit. A little bit longer might not be the worst. I feel like and not a lot of these ooh I was like who the fuck okay ooh rough okay you gotta as, as a wise man once said you've gotta get your get your get your head in the game oh yeah maybe you should have brought it I don't like how this man's looking at us Victor the game's going on um Get your head out of your ass. Yeah. Tonight, okay? right. Yeah. Someone needs to give him a little... Just like a playful slap in the face. Yeah, no. 
touch the ground. Yeah, because you took like four steps. You know what I mean? You like skipped. Seat and cool down. You're benching me? This is bullshit. Yes. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, yeah. We're like, what's going on? I'm not the one having an affair behind dad's back. You cheated on dad with his boss. Oh, yeah. We all know this. Yeah. I know. Yeah, we know you know. She told me everything, and it wasn't easy, but hey, she was honest. Okay, that's... I'm happy you two are working through that. What's your boss? And you, you think she's honest? Oh, wait, no, we are not doing this here. Not in front of your little brother, so just get in oh. the car. Oh, yeah, secret's out. Victor, get in the car. Okay. Oh, we're just leaving. It, the game only just started. Holy shit. <sighs> Uh, no, I mean, right, let's go. You can't, mom, you can't be mad about that because, like, we wouldn't be angry because you did that and it, cheating is not a good thing. So, like, your mom and I, we're, yeah, we're not perfect. No, no one is. That's, that is good. So, wait, this is why we moved? Yeah, now they're going to blame her. I did with dad's boss? I'm so sorry, Miguel's. And that's why they had to uproot their lives. Hey, I'm so, I am so, so sorry. I, they, I feel like they'll, they'll move forward, but it's going to take time. But you admit it, as we say here on this channel, when you do something wrong, you admit it, you acknowledge it, you feel bad for it, you learn from it, and you move on trying to be a better person. Not the bad guy. Thank you for not telling him the rest. Okay, yep, Dad's still... Already, why should they hate you too? Did he beat up the boss? What happened? I just thought like I, I knew her. Oh, thank, it's good we told Mia. But, you know, Mum, I believe that, you know, she is, you know, she does feel bad about it. And it's good she wants to work to be better and commit to their relationship. I don't want to admit that I wasn't enough to make her stay. <sighs> oh, Mia. Lying doesn't hurt as much. That sucks. But hey, I, I, I know... You have my heart. Is a lot. We both got problems. You're cheering for you at the game and she loves you an embarrassing amount. <laughs> she really does. It's wild. Try to forgive her. Oh, you don't even have to forgive her yet. You just have to, you know, not hate her maybe. That's, I feel like, where you have to be. Look at the silver lining. If she hadn't made that mistake, then you wouldn't have moved here and we wouldn't have met. Yeah, and be boyfriend. Friend, no, emphasis on friend, friend girlfriend. Which walking away from. That's sweet. Is that right? Yeah, you have to know that you're worth it, and you like have such value in your. It's nice that he can. He can not like show you just show her like just instill that like fire in herself that she's like so amazing and cool of a person i think to have a person that can ignite what you have and make you believe in yourself is really good it was really amazing like <sighs> seeing victor and mia get that sort of bond like it's so hard because um you, they're not gonna last, and I don't think they can. I don't know what I. I think I. I remember there been like something between Benji and Victor happening that is like them like kind of maybe getting together, but not getting together. I don't really know. And something about me and knowing something. My mind's hazy, but I feel like either way for this sort of show, you know, I feel like they're not gonna last, but I hope they can they can stick with this some sort of like friendship um because what they have is really special and the the way they bond they are like their best friends 
at the moment that they're like in a relationship, but I hope they could they could keep that and going forward because I think it's it's really good for both of them. I really love both of them and I want them to be, you know, strong and together and happy. And it's hard because like they have that beautiful like family things to connect at. They're telling people things they don't tell anyone else. Uh and I, I, I'm a bit worried about um, how it's going to end because Mia's a really interesting and unique and and cool and fun character. And I don't want to see, like, less of her going on. That's, like, a worry. I'm, like, I don't want her to have to, like, not be in it as much because um, we have been, Like, I want to see Victor and Benji, but I don't want to lose Mia to it. Uh, so it's one of those things. But the whole thing with the mama, it's... It's hard because obviously cheating's bad. That sucks. Uh, but we we want like things to still be good in their family, and you don't want them to all be not liking each other or hating. You want you know them to to work towards it. And I I think at least mum acknowledging it and then working on their like relationship is good. But there's something going on with dad which I do not remember, and there's something happening, and I don't know what's going on there. So I'm interested about that too. So more secrets to see. But <laughs> I'm, I'm talking about like we're ending. We're gonna go into the um, next episode. But I thought I should at least give my thoughts uh, before uh, we go into. Um, I was like, what episode are we doing? Uh, season one, episode five. Okay, <laughs> we we haven't we haven't jumped in time or anything. I just had to go find a jumper, therefore explaining the uh, the uh, <laughs> change in outfit. But we do move on to the next episode. Remember, I've been my family's fixer. Oh. There's no problem I can't smooth over with a well-timed joke, a charming anecdote. No, that's so much like to have on a kid. Oh, well, I could go for pancakes. <laughs> I love pancakes. Here's the stove. Eat your pancakes. Smells uh, yes, because he is the glue of this family. Hey, what you want to do for your birthday this Saturday? <gasps> I thought we could throw you a party. Yeah, could be fun. It's okay. It's such short notice. I'm sure everyone has plans, you know? Oh. Yeah, sometimes you just want a cruisy birthday. You don't have to do something crazy. Yeah, all right. See you soon, mommy. Bye. Oh. See you soon. Why are you going to see her soon? Oh, my parents want to visit for Victor's birthday this weekend. Oh, fun. I want it done in the house. Seriously? Do ha, she... To me. And now on top of that, I can have your mom here hating me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, more fighting, more fighting. Yeah, yeah, it'll be fun. I mean, yeah, you guys can meet my... And then that takes away from... Tito can celebrate with us. Our family. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm so excited. Okay, I'm s I'm happy and nervous. Maybe something fun and distracting was exactly Party time. What we needed to get our I don't know, I'm fucking worried. Family, parties, friends, a lot. I don't know. But mixing family, friends and all these secrets seems like a bad decision. Not like a bad decision, but it seems like it could be a wild experience. Uh, every time we get that shot of them dancing, I like my little heart. My little heart just expands. Hoping my grandfather's gotten more open-minded. That it doesn't sound like it. Hey, with a furry one. It's my oh. Elsa one from Frozen. Yeah. She turns things into ice. And she like was ready to murder a couple of people, so like Elsa's pretty cool. Oh no, uh, that's actually a hand-me-down from Pilar. He usually uses it to um, to sword fight. Yeah, he's a very macho boy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he's just been a kid. He's a kitty. Also, like, Elsa's kind of fucking badass. I'm just going to be like, what, that's not my favorite Disney movie or anything, but she was ready to murder, like, everyone, which was great. <laughs> <laughs> At least one of your boys is gonna give me some great grandchildren. Oh, get over yourself. A grandchildren, if you're not gonna love any child, do you need another child to not love if they're different? Also, he could adopt and you could have wonderful other grandchildren. Like, just actual grand. Like, you know what? Ooh! Neither like me. Oh my god, yeah. 
next level into him, aren't you? Also, I think his mum knows what it's like to have a mum hate her, so she might be nice to you. This party? What? This is my house. I can wear what I want in my house. I like the Billie Eilish shirt. It looks nice. Have your abuela giving me another lecture on how I let you listen to devil music. Okay, there's definitely worse devil music than Billie Eilish, still. And sees you. Fine, I'll go to my room, but I'm not coming to this stupid party just so we can all pretend we're still a happy family. Oh! Okay, well, let's move on from that. Mom, this is... This is Mia. Mia. Hello. Hello. Sorry, you had to see that. That's okay. My mom and I had a pretty terrible relationship sometimes, too. We don't have... That was horrid. Had a fight. Yeah. No, of course. I am. Um... No, she was just trying to liken... I don't know. I don't know what I meant. <laughs> yeah, Mia, yeah, it's okay. It's okay. That was a blunder. A little something for the birthday party. Oh, this is sweet. Is it Carly Rae Jepsen? I hope so. Park in front of a hydrant. Oh. So nobody set anything on fire. Ha 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 I hate you. Once. Victor! Oh. These are... This is Benji, my coworker, and, and his Derek, his uh, bandmate. Band oh, I hate that bandmate. See. <laughs> oh yeah, it's tough. It's tough. It's tough. It's tough. Family's going through a hard time right now. I and they could explode. Father makes a scene. It'll lead to a fight between my parents, and I just. I not sure get where Benji and. Fuck face is coming from. <laughs> I don't like him. Um, I get where they're coming from because like you shouldn't have to hide yourself. You should be yourself wherever you are. You, you know, like you're fucking. It's not the biggest deal in the world. People should get the fuck over it. It's you know all that, all that and more. But I'm. I feel like I'm that sort of person where I'm like, if someone's like, if I showed up with a boyfriend to a friend's place and they're like, hey, can you just like. You know, do that for... I'd be like... Yeah. He's, I think, <laughs> like, it's kind of, like, dumb and an annoying. But, and, like, it's horrible that you have to do it. But I feel like doing that for a friend is kind of excusable. I don't know. Am I in the minority on that? Maybe. But also, you could just, like, play it as, like, a fun... I would be, like... I would be, like, acting the whole time. I'd be like... Yeah, hey dudes, I would just, I would have so much fun with it. I think it would just turn into a weird drama performance, which probably doesn't really show that macho madness, but I would be like, hell yeah, sports. I don't know. I think it'd be just the wildest time. Not today, Pilar. It is her brother's birthday and you can't even get her to come out of her room? Well, you go do it then, bitch. Her, if you want. Sure, have at it. Oh, I, I can't deal with this. I am too, my family, I feel like is very honest with each other. And I feel like we don't deal with this too brutally honest, but. Are too busy. In between music and school. Sports. The time today? Bros. I don't, I'm just saying, it would be a funny, I'd be hilarious. I feel like it shows a real, like, it's, you know, showing that to your friend. I, it, it sucks and it's hard. Do that. Oh, his smolder is very attractive. <laughs> I'm just gonna say right now, he's a very attractive man. And Clyde. But seriously though, I think my heart is going to explode. Your feel. <laughs> She's like, you got a chest, my guy. Ew, kiss. I want, I'm more excited for them. Okay, well. It looks like the coast is clear, so we should. I'm just my guy Felix is too adorable. On the prowl for a spontaneous hottie, so. He's a spontaneous hottie. You were literally, literally, literally spont spontaneated. <laughs> just love him. He needs someone to love. Be straight for some homophobic old man. Can you not right now? Yeah, I hate his boyfriend. Not for that this reason. I just hate how complaining he is. Obviously, the, it is a, a problem. I would have a ball with it. It's like an assignment. I'd be like, yes, sir. Acting straight. No. I'm sorry. Okay? Okay. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> yeah, that doesn't really hide that they're bandmates. No, I'm 
not fighting anymore, okay? Same. He's like, why are there men kissing in the house? Actually, in, in this state, that's how you say thank you. You just give a quick kiss on the lips. <laughs> Together? Yeah. You need to tell them not to do that here. Why? What if your little brother sees them? Um, he sees them and realizes love is love. Please, it's a family party. Yeah. Gay people have families too. Ooh, I'm going to hold it together. Ooh, I'd get up and bitch slap both those men. You know, I just, you know, I just fucking fully slap. I'd hurt slap. <laughs> I would go for the kill. I'm sorry, Poppy. I really wanted today to go smoothly, but... But fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. I'm not yeah. going to tell them not to be who they are if that bothers you. That's your problem. Not theirs and not mine. This is how Preach. you teach your son to speak to his abuelo? Oh, shut up, you shitty old bitch. <laughs> it is. Thank you. I raised him to be true to himself and to stand up for the people that he cares about. Amazing. I do my best. Natalia, every day. It's all I can do, and I am sorry. And you have been a rude cunt. Isabel is amazing, and she's raising yes. her kids to be good, decent people. Yeah, and not judgy little fucks. You need to give her a break. Amen. Oh, solidarity. It's hard for us, that's all. Everything hard for is what? Changing. Uh, Boohoo. Yeah, but it's Our not that. Our kids can barely speak Spanish. Okay, maybe that Boys that's that's something I can't relate on. Of... That's not that hard. But you don't have to care. Everything that matters to us is disappearing. But they do it, and you just move on with your day. Birthday to oh. <laughs> Yeah, how about them being happy? Yeah, how about let like, kids be happy? I know. Crazy thought process. Maybe... Wait, where'd everyone else in the party go? Are they hiding behind the, the wall? Maybe kids being allowed to be happy is just like a, a good thing that should happen and like letting them just flourish is good. He's into a pumpkin if he's not watching reality TV by 10. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. The, the Derek hate is strong on this channel. And it's still hard for me to be who I am. I would say... And for the record, I think who you are is it's pretty great. <laughs> so, Sorry. I like my I'm, I, that was adorable. I love them. The fact that we get us like a slow burn and it's so small, like, it's like a build. I hate it because I like Mia so much. Dear Victor... Happy birthday to Okay, Derek. Come on, bro. They're singing happy birthday. You can't leave mid birthday. <laughs> He's like, I wish Derek was dead. Oh my god, me too, brother. <laughs> no hate to the actor. It's the character. We hate the character. Derek the character. Death. Death to them. The actor, hope he's happy and healthy. <laughs> I gotta make the distinction here. Thanks, too. I mean, not that, not that I'm your. Oh my god. <laughs> no, I actually hate this because they they're so cute, but I don't want them to be together because I want him and Benji. Of course, you're my girlfriend. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be hard for her. It's really embarrassing. It was actually kind of really adorable. I wonder what he's gonna feel. When he kisses Benji for the first time, compared to Mia. Because, like, I'm sure he loves her, but different sensation. Different sensation. Different sensation. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> There's a lot of different things going on. You asked me to make a wish tonight, and... I wish for Benji. I didn't even know how to put what I want into words. Call me, baby. Cully Ray Jepsen. Oh, but I guess if I had to try. Wait, that's actually really cute. I wish that 16 will be the year I finally figure out what I want. And what I want is men. I mean him too, but... <laughs> Never knew how you felt about that. What yeah. business is it of mine what some boys in your school are up to? 
he's like, oh, it's, oh, is it going to go bad? Okay. That. That did those wrong and your little brother doesn't turn out that way. Anyway, oh. I love you. Happy birthday. How about we, we teach him not to say it like that either? Because either way, if you got, we, you kind of got a, a bit of a gay son currently, but even if you had two gay kids, you should be fucking proud of them nonetheless. Cause he's exactly the same. They are like exactly the same now as if they are after they come out. They're the same person. It's just a different label. Um, this episode was like good and hard. It was like tough because like the thing is Mia. Okay. So like they, they write this like really well, which I enjoy because it's hard because like they, they write Mia so well. And she's such a character that you can like, you know, relate to. And she she's really cool and interesting. And like, you, you're like smart, thoughtful. She's a very like good, well done character. And you see how she bonds. And I said this after the last one, but she's, you know, she's bonding with Victor. And she's trying. And she really, you can see how much she cares. And she's going through her own shit. And you love the way they are like falling in love with each other. And... It's great. It's like really good to see and really enjoyable. But then you have that complete like juxtaposition of like wanting Victor to be with Benji because we're on this journey and you want them to fall in love. But it's hard because you don't want to see Mia get hurt, which sucks. And I feel like we're going to have to deal with this at some point. I don't know when it's coming, but I'm scared for it. But like, I want to see Victor flourish, but I don't want to see Mia fall. That's the really hard... It's like that whole... I'm like, I want Victor... The You know, the more Victor becomes himself or gets the things he wants, the more Mia's going to lose, which is hard. Because, you know, they're, they're having a good time together. It's tough. It's hard. I, I feel bad for her, but, like, those cute, sweet moments. And the drawing from Benji is so nice. And also, like, it was, like, pretty good. I, if I got that, I'd be like, are you in love with me or something? Like, why are you, why are you taking drawing? Why are you doing drawings of me at work? I'd be like, are you obsessed with me? Because I am in love with you. <laughs> I don't know. This, this show is just, like, cute and sweet, and I love it. And even the conflict is, like, everything's very well written. I feel like you could feel everything going on which I really like and then when it dissolves you're like yes it feels very I don't know there's just something about it that's very endearing and I see why so many people like it and when I, I see in the comments again thank you for all the comments I love them I love reading them you know people who are like not even compare it just like talking about like how this like ranks for them for like between their other shows and our other like you know our heart stopper our younger all our different ones like that all the shows that we love um this definitely does have like a very like real grounded feeling to it. And it's a lot of, it's still got that heightened, like high schooly, like dumb sense, but I do like how many avenues it goes down, which is really interesting. Uh, but for now, I just, uh, we're, we're done for this week and I can't wait till next week. Well, luckily I get to watch it earlier because I get to record whenever I want. But um, yeah, I, uh, I hope you enjoyed and are having a fantastic day and I hope to see you in the next one.